Hey, welcome back to JD's Arcade. For our review in 10 today, we are going to spin our wheel and see what we get. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to go with the number 23. 23 is going to be our number and our letter for today, excluding Y or Z, since I've got those way too many times, is I. Intrepid was made in 1983 by Nova Games of Canada and developed also by Nova Games LTD. It's an action, action, labyrinth game. I'm just going to go into this blind. I'm not going to do any reading on it. Let's see what it's all about. Intrepid, here is our load screen. Right. Got a little detective action to it. These guys up here, it is what appears to be Russia. You can see some of the Russian buildings there in the top. Let's pop some credits. We have ourselves a co-op game, maxing out at nine. Let's see what we got. Spy one, get ready for your mission. So this immediately reminds me of elevator action right off the base here. Get in there. I've got my elevator. I am controlling where I go here. I'm not really sure what to do. Let's see if I can open oh, my door here. Uh, here's the labyrinth part of it. So I got a little... Hey there, security guard. All right, we're going to get trapped in here if we're not careful. Suck it. You guys suck at your job. I'm going to go up the stairs if I can. Shoot. You're on it. All right, we're running. We are running. Oh, go! 74, 52, 30. Should have went left. With the Star Wars music. Dude, come on. What is that? That was a map. Oh, shit. Bring it there, daddy. Mm, you sack of Jewia. Am I in my coffin? I'm dead? No, oh, no. Got another turn. We're going, we got a big key. Should we go up to that top one? I feel like we should, right? There. Get this guy the hell out of here. Boom. All right, I'm in. I'm in. We got a vault. 74, 52, 30. I think we gotta go in the last door, right? Is there something there that's gonna help us? Glasses. The disguise! Ah, that's funny. Alright, get the hell out of here. Hopefully our speed shoes, I think. Alright, 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 alright. Go! Yes! All right, up! Go! You got it this time. You got it. All right, get out of here, bro. 74, 52, 30. Go. Yes. Oh, I didn't have to have it memorized. I've recovered the secret plans. Leave the embassy as quickly as possible. I got to get the f out of here, people. Which way is going to be blocked? Go. Mm-hmm. Really? I got the speed shoes and you're going to go that route? Oh, mother of pearl. All right, guys, I got to say, that was kind of exciting. Let's give this another run. I'm assuming it's going to be very similar. Pull up in my sports car. Oh, there's my guys up there. I missed them the first time. All right, so we are looking for disguises. I'm not really sure what the umbrella was supposed to do. Come on, you mofo. Suck it. Oh my god, are you kidding me with that? <laughs> coming at the last minute? Suck it.
All right, there is our combination. We do not have to memorize it. It is not in the same location as it was before. Oh, sh oh my God. Did you guys see that juke? Oh my God, crazy. Crazy. There's nothing I can do there. So it does seem as though the hidden items are not in the same place. I'm not super observant about that the first time around, but I swear in that room that they were not. So that means that I have to check these last two spots out to make sure you little Sally. Oh, dude. Now, if I could find these shoes, that would be the key. Those shoes are fast. Alright, ID, the map, nothing, nothing, oh, yeah, yeah, let's go, come on. Come on, get me sucker. Alright, there's the disguise and the shoes in the last room. Go, go, go. Go. All right, we're out. All right, into the key room. The disguise is set. We're going to go in. Going super fast. Boom. Give me that money, sonny. All right, now we got to get the out of here. Da, da, da. That, oh, that was oh Canada. Wait, do I have to go up there? I gotta get out of this embassy. Out of the embassy, it said. Mission two. All right, same type of setup. Now, I'm going to test a theory here, because so I remember from the last room, there's only two... Oh, bruh. Really? What's sneaky about this, and the, them being red, is that they could be hiding in these rooms waiting to kill me like that guy there's nothing I can do about it alright I need to get that wrench oh my god there's four we get four in this room nothing nothing I didn't get it so I gotta go back that's the worst part oh, I didn't even get the password dude are you serious Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> that was the same password as the first level. <sighs> Trepid. That was a fun game. Usually the older arcade games uh, can be a little cheesy, a little corny. Um, this one kind of remind me of the review in 10 I did on 005. It was a little similar to that, except better. Uh, play was fun. Uh, you're just looking for hidden items. Uh, very similar just to hide and seek, except you're outrunning your other people. Graphically, it's what you would expect from a 1983 arcade game. Uh, the sound also matches the fact that it was from 1983. Value is tremendous. Uh, I got both of those plays in for two quarters, so I get about six minutes per play. Uh, and I could have kept going, but I was at my timer's end. So overall, guys, Intrepid, I think is definitely a fun one to check out. It's quirky. I liked it. I'm going to go ahead and give it a 74. I'm going to go 74 on that one. It was a good one. All right, want to check that one out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is JD. Another review in 10. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time.